What's up, folks? MC here. So, I shared a story on Facebook that uh, about me, and it was I think it was a few months ago during the winter. It was it was a messed up day, messed up weather, and uh, and I took my shoes that, that I had on, and I gave them to a uh, to a homeless guy, and there was a guy who questioned whether I actually did it. You know, and I, I'm all about metaphors and stories, but I think it's important that guys don't uh, think that I'm full of shit. So what I'm going to do is I actually, I found the homeless guy that uh, I gave the shoes to, and he's over there sleeping. I don't know if you guys could see. Right? So I found him. I just drove around the block, and uh, I'm actually going to see if he still has my shoes or if he remembers me. All right, so uh, hopefully he doesn't fucking freak out because I had a short conversation with the guy. I've given the guy money on a couple of occasions and stuff, but y y I mean, you never know. I mean, I guess if he had all his uh, marbles together, he wouldn't be sleeping in a, uh, in a in a bench or a, a little camping seat in the middle of the Bronx in the street. But let's see. Let's go. Excuse me, brother. Sir? Yes. How you doing? Do you remember me? I gave you a pair of shoes. Of sneakers? <laughs> yeah. Right, right. You remember? You still have them? Yes. You still have, have you used them? Uh, I'm wearing these first. All right. That's awesome. You mind? Are they in your, uh, your thing right here? Yeah. I just want to see them because I told somebody that I gave them to you. Yeah, they're all the way there. It's a lot I have to take. Oh, no, no. I won't. You don't have to touch anything. I'm just going to see if I can see it from the outside. Is that cool? I won't even touch it. I won't even touch it. I promise you. What's your name, by the way? Charlie. Charlie, I'm Justin. Thank you. They were Timberlands. And I think that's that. Yeah. Yep, there they are. Right there. Right? You still got them. Good. That's awesome. All right, Charlie. Take it easy, brother. What's up, folks? MC, I'm back on my car. I hit the stop record button by accident. But um, I'm glad I... Uh, I, I got to talk to Charlie. I'm glad that uh, he still has the shoes, and um, I guess I'm not glad that uh, that somebody actually questioned uh, me and the story of me giving my shoes to a homeless guy. Um, the way it worked out is I had my uh, my flip flops, my Academy flip flops, in my uh, in my truck, and it was a miserable day. It had to be 30 something degrees and like that sleety, rainy, just miserable miserable weather and he was sitting out there and he had a uh, an umbrella and he was standing but he had these terrible terrible shoes i was stuck in a light i saw it it was like you know what fuck it so a uh, pair of timberland gore-tex for my man um charity charity is something that everybody should embrace charity is something that uh that too many people brag about now i know i'm sitting here making a freaking video you know about just one thing that I did, you know, but I think the, the, the bigger lesson here is that, you know, don't, don't assume that, that people, you know, aren't charitable. Don't assume that people aren't, you know, looking out for, uh, for their brothers and sisters. I mean, the guy, Charlie, I'm so glad I got his name. Finally. Um, he's a military vet, you know, the small talk I had made with him, you know, and I'd given him the shoes. He's a Vietnam vet. And, um, and obviously he's been struggling with his own issues afterwards, but you know, there's a lot of ways to show gratitude and, uh, charity for those that deserve it. Um, and when you, when you can, uh, when you actually have the, uh, the wherewithal and the ability to help, um, it, it's always a great feeling for everybody involved. Right. So for the guy that, uh, that thought I was making that story up, well, I hope this clears it up for you. Uh, for the rest of you, uh, the pressure project.com, uh, podcast is taking off. We're doing great things. And uh, helping people become better people and helping men become better men. Peace.